for the first time in a long time, the United States taking military action in Iraq. Earlier today, News Aid talked to U.S. Senator Chris Murphy to get his take on these latest developments. Senator Murphy praised the decision by the Obama administration to airlift emergency aid, food and water to thousands of Iraqis who have fled to the mountains to escape advancing Islamic extremists. Well, there's clearly a humanitarian imperative right now. You've got people trapped up on a hill who are threatened with extinction and the United States uh, is right to come to their aid. But the Democrat is not as resolute about the other phase of today's military action. The U.S. airstrikes targeting Sunni extremists who are moving towards the city of Erbil, where America has both diplomatic and military personnel. The president is doing this to protect our personnel there, but a lot of us are going to worry that this will escalate into a much bigger U.S. involvement that's really about trying to play favorites in a conflict between Shia and Sunni. Uh, that's a dangerous game to get into for the United States. In an official statement, Murphy also said Americans will not support a new open-ended military campaign in Iraq adding that the president needs to better explain how this intervention is strictly time and scope limited. And we have been getting a good bit of reaction to this latest U.S. intervention in Iraq. Here's what our viewers have been saying. We ask if you agree with the new military action. 61% say they believe the action being taken is the right course, while only 27% say they are against the attack. 11% tell us they're on the fence, and we want to hear your thoughts on this issue. Give a call to our Voice of the People hotline number at area code 203-212-WTNH.